Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is Air. Question number 1. Which is the most important layer of the atmosphere? Option A. Troposphere. Option B. Thermosphere. Option C. Mesosphere. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Troposphere. Troposphere layer is the most important layer of the atmosphere. Its average height is 13 kilometers. The air we breathe exists here. Question number 2. What is responsible for the excess of CO2? Option A. Global warming. Option B. Global cooling. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Global warming. When its level in the atmosphere increases due to factory smoke or car fumes, the heat retained increases the temperature of the earth. This is called global warming. Question number 3. What is the result when the air is heated? Option A. Heavier. Option B. Lighter. Option C. Colder. Option D. Warmer. The correct answer is Option B. Lighter. When air is heated, it expands, becomes lighter, and goes up. Cold air is denser and heavy. Question number 4. Stratosphere contains a layer of which gas? Option A. Nitrogen gas. Option B. Ozone gas. Option C. Helium gas. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Ozone gas. One important feature of stratosphere is that it contains a layer of ozone gas. Question number 5. In which layers all weather phenomenon occurs? Option A. Troposphere. Option B. Stratosphere. Option C. Thermosphere. Option D. Mesosphere. The correct answer is Option A. Troposphere. Troposphere layer is the most important layer of the atmosphere. Its average height is 13 kilometers. The air we breathe exists here. Almost all the weather phenomena like rainfall, fog and hailstorm occur in this layer. Question number 6. As we go up in the layers of the atmosphere what is the effect in the pressure? Option A. Increases. Option B. Decreases. Option C. Remains the same. Option D. All of these. The correct answer is Option B. Decreases. The air pressure is highest at sea level and decreases with height. The amount of insulation decreases from the equator towards the poles. Therefore, the temperature decreases in the same manner. Question number 7. In which direction the wind blows constantly throughout the year in particular direction? Option A. Permanent winds. Option B. Local winds. Option C. Seasonal winds. Option D. Both A and B. The correct answer is Option A. Permanent winds. Permanent winds is the trade winds. Westerlies and easterlies are the permanent winds. These blow constantly throughout the year in a particular direction. Question number 8. Which one of the following is a local wind? Option A. Sea breeze. Option B. Trade wind. Option C. Monsoon wind. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Sea breeze. Local winds blow only during a particular period of the day or year in a small area. For example, 
land and sea breeze. Question number 9. Which of the following gases protects us from harmful sun rays? Option A. Carbon dioxide. Option B. Nitrogen. Option C. Ozone. Option D. All of these. The correct answer is Option C. Ozone. One important feature of stratosphere is that it contains a layer of ozone gas. We know that it protects us from the harmful effect of the sun rays. Question number 10. Which of the following layers of the atmosphere is free from clouds? Option A. Troposphere. Option B. Stratosphere. Option C. Mesosphere. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Stratosphere. Stratosphere layer is almost free from clouds and associated weather phenomenon, making conditions most ideal for flying aeroplanes. Question number 11. Which gases make the bulk of the atmosphere? Option A. Nitrogen. Option B. Oxygen. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option C. Both A and B. Nitrogen, 78%, and oxygen, 21%, make the bulk of atmosphere. Question number 12. Which gas creates greenhouse effect in the atmosphere? Option A. Carbon dioxide. Option B. Ozone. Option C. Oxygen. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide treats greenhouse effect in the atmosphere. Question number 13. How ozone layer is important to us? Option A. Protect us from weather changes. Option B. Protect us from harmful rays. Option C. Protect us from rain. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Protect us from harmful rays. It protects us from the harmful effect of the sun rays. Question number 14. What do you mean by insulation? Option A. Outgoing rays. Option B. Insulators rays. Option C. Incoming solar energy. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option C. Incoming solar energy. Insulation is the incoming solar energy intercepted by the Earth. Question number 15. What do you mean by weather? Option A. Incoming solar energy. Option B. All condition of the atmosphere. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. All condition of the atmosphere, weather is hour to hour, day to day condition of the atmosphere. Question number 16. What do you mean by loo? Option A. Hot and dry wind. Option B. Cold wind. Option C. Rainy wind. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Hot and dry wind. Lu is the hot and dry wind of northern plains of India. Question number 17. Name the types of rainfall. Option A. Cyclonic. Option B. Orographic. Option C. Convectional. Option D. All of the above. The correct answer is Option D. All of the above. Convectional rainfall, orographic rainfall, cyclonic rainfall are the type of rainfall. Question number 18. Which places receive the highest amount of annual rainfall in the world? 
ऑप्शन ए बिहार ऑप्शन बी मेघालय ऑप्शन सी भोपाल ऑप्शन डी जम्मू द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी मेघालय मोसिन राम इन मेघालय रिसीव हाइएस्ट अमाउंट ऑफ रेनफॉल इन द वर्ल्ड क्वेश्चन नंबर 19. वॉट इज एयर प्रेशर ऑप्शन ए प्रेशर एक्सर्टेड बाय द विंड ऑप्शन बी प्रेशर एक्सर्टेड बाय द रेन ऑप्शन सी प्रेशर एक्सर्टेड बाय द वेट ऑफ एयर ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ दीज The correct answer is option C. Pressure exerted by the weight of air. The pressure exerted by the weight of air on the earth's surface is known as the air pressure. Question number 20. When precipitation comes down to the earth in the liquid form, it is called option A, cloud. Option B, snow. Option C, rain. Option D, fog. The correct answer is option C rain clouds are just masses of many water droplets when these droplets of water become too heavy to float in air then they come down as precipitation in the form of rain thank you for watching the video if you'd like practice this quiz then download the wonderslate app now link in the description below if you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.